let's get these bad boy down pipes installed. JK. I got a used set of arc down pipes for the whip. I also have headers that I listed for sale on the page. I'm not really gonna, I don't think I'm gonna install the headers. I don't know if I'm gonna get too much rasp or what it's gonna sound like, and I don't know if I wanna find out. For now though, we'll install the down pipes just cause mine are trashed and ripped on the flux pipe. All right. So these are looking a bit rusty and moldy. Well, not rusty, just on there for quite a while. I'm gonna hit it with the WD-40, let it sit. Ooh, steamy. Straight up, just what you said, it got all steamy right now. <laughs> oh, no. There's the current condition of that one. This one's actually in good shape. It's not bad, but the other one is all messed up, so we'll replace them. The more I look, the more scratched up shit I find all this. These plastics right here are all broken. The oil drain plug is all scraped. Whatever that is broke off. And then, where is it? Whatever this is, gone. Yep. Lower your car, they said. Well, now we got the bags. But we like to cruise low, so we still scraping this shit. All right, so we got all four bolts off, two back ones. Oh, shit. Where are they? Two front ones, so everything is free, but I'm gonna remove the O2 sensor, whatever it is. I think it's O2 sensor. And before I start taking this apart, have this off. So it's not dangling. Same thing on the other side. Well, I still got to get all the four nuts off on that other side. But easy process. I was going to say that by far removing those shits was the worst because I hate them. But them O2 sensors, boy, they shut. I don't want to come out. These are all my chanclas. They the work boys right here. Still got a whole another one of those. So. This turning has given up a little bit. Bite another drink. Oh, there she goes. There she goes. No lady. Gotta... What, did it get all damaged? No. Oh. A little. Yeah. Alright, so there was only one that was being an asshole. This one came out on the first crack. It wasn't really stuck. I don't think they matter which side they go back on, right? They're just sensors. They're just sensors. Should I put anti seize on them? Nah. Probably won't take them off again. Nah, we'll leave them on there. We like to struggle next time we take things off. Well, she's in there, but this thing was all like cross threaded and fucked up. Now, I've never removed these, so. Hyundai Tux, y'all ain't doing your work. Put that cross threaded, and you owe me a wrench. Well, you owe mono a wrench. Cause I broke it, putting that thing back on there. I know, I didn't realize it broke. I thought I thought that had broke when it snapped off. Whatever, they're both on there now, that's all that matters. Sorry to whoever takes my Gen X and has to take that off. I apologize in advance. 
Well, there they are. Arc downpipes installed. Once again, I just have a random three inch straight pipe from their back with no resonators at all. I just have the ISR race muffler all the way in the back. So it kind of makes it pretty quiet until you're on, you know, wide open throttle on it. I don't think these pipes are gonna do anything to the noise or power, but my flex pipes were done on the other one and I had these sitting around, so I figured I'd change them. Yeah, hit it. I don't think there's any difference at all. It's the same pipe. Whatever, there, there's mental difference, you know? I feel like it's different. Uh -huh. Give it like a small little rev. Something's loose back here, watch come. Hit it, hit it again. You hear the like little rasp after? Hit it again. dude that those things tossed off the center of my exhaust pipes so this one look how it is and now this one hits right here what so when I installed the down pipes they kind of fit a little more snug and it changed the center of my exhausts ah oh that's no good my diffuser you can turn it off Man, if it ain't one thing, it's another. Step on it.